And now, Boating Basics with Mark Kimura. How's it, gang? This is Mark Kimura from Honolulu Community Colleges, Marine Education and Training Center. I'd like to speak to you today about compasses. How accurate is your compass? How do you read it? I was just talking to a young man the other day, and he deals with a handheld compass. And the handheld compass has a needle that you line up with north, and then you look your direction which way it goes. A lot of boat compasses do not deal that way. They will have generally a card with a line that you read off of. And this line will give you the direction you're going instead of trying to get a needle to point to north. So as you're steering along, the card will rotate and in relationship to the line is where or the direction that you are traveling. A lot of the high-end compasses will be a bigger card and you'll be able to see the whole 360 degrees of the compass and it will give you a return line on the back side of the compass so you know how to get back from where you've been. Say if you're going north, you can turn on a head south to return home. Um, this is a very simple compass, but all compasses are magnetic. So if you put something within range of the compass, you can very easily make the compass swing to an incorrect reading on the card or incorrect reading that you're driving. So you need to uh, pick a location on the dashboard that's highly visible, generally right in front of you and making sure it's square and straight. You need to be careful how close your electronics are to it because it will cause the compass to swing. And a compass that swings will not read accurately. It could be something that it will have to be uh, powered up or energized and that may cause it to swing to a different number. Okay? So pick a good location, try to keep metals away from it. Most compasses will have some means of adjusting it. This one, it's right here on the bottom. The east-west, the north-south. So if the compass does not quite read properly, most compasses will have means of adjusting it so it does. The other way you can check a compass, besides with another compass or something you trust that's accurate or GPS, is that the range markers that will align you coming in and out of the channels for the, some of the different harbors. If you go on the chart, we'll tell you exactly what the compass reading to or from the harbor is. So you sit down, you line up the two range markers and read that on your compass and you can sit down and adjust your compass so it will read properly. Then you turn around and go the other direction and then you can check it again. Okay gang, this is Mark Kimura from Honolulu Community Colleges, Marine Education and Training Center. Aloha gang.